hello everyone welcome again to my channel okay so in this video we'll again talk about the relationship stuff in the power app portal right so here you can see that then the front screen is showing the record of the parent entity and whenever you click any item of the parent entity a form appears on the screen and this form shows the, the details and the related records right so i it is loading somewhere right okay so it is also showing the related records okay so what it is it is doing it is simply and uh, showing the subgrid right so as we have worked in the model driven in the model driven case whenever we add any subgrid there is a button comes on the top of the subgrid whenever the user click on the that button he can create the new child record of the selected parent record right without selecting the parent record right so how we can do this in the power portal this is the, something we are going to discuss in this video okay so here you can see that this form is showing the records right so how we can make this form to create the new record new child record without selecting the parent record okay so in that case what we need to do uh, here you can see the parent three in that parent three record uh, just I just apologize for this little um, late. It is taking little time. Okay. Mm, I don't know why it is taking too much time. <laughs> Here you can see these are the three records. Okay. So what we are doing, we need to do some. We need to insert some logic in that form, which is coming on the screen which makes user to create the new child record without selecting the parent record right so for that you need to again know the name of that form right so in my case the form name you need to just go to the power App portal management application like, like whenever you create any portal our portal management app model driven app automatically created right so you need to go to that portal management model driven app and inside that go to the entity forms again and search for your form in that case in my case this is parent detail added mode form right this is my form that comes on the screen whenever i click any item of the parent entity right so i simply click on that here i can see there is an additional setting right once i click on this additional setting it is showing me action button configuration right so here you can see this create related record button is there if I click on this, I need to simply enter the entity name, which entity record I want to create, right? So obviously there should be some relationship um, should be there, which uh, combines this parent record, this uh, form to the entity form whose records we need to create, we are going to create, right? So in my case, the name of that entity is world. World and the relationship is there like we are having one to n relationship this is target type entity form i'm like i'm using entity form you can if you have any page in your portal which is having the form of the world or your child entity then the web page will option will also come on the screen but in my case only entity form is there and you need to in uh, like uh, add a form which is in the insert mode you get you have added one form to the power up portal which are in the insert mode okay so i have added one uh, form and the button so i'll use add new child right and after that i'll simply save and close and i'll again go to my power up portal and refresh this once it would be refreshed then i simply click clicking any item of the parent entity and here you can see there's no record in the child entity but you have noticed that one button is there aside of to the submit button right so add new child if i click on that a form appears on the screen like uh, to the sake of your knowledge i would say this form is of the child entity form right so i'll write Word one of parent three. So here 
is no description of this child right and i'm simply submitting it here you can see i haven't select whose child i'm making so it is taking by default like here you can see now it comes on the screen in the parent it is on selected automatically that the, we are creating the child of the parent three item right so that's how we can create the child record okay so thank you for watching this video guys so uh, we have more couple of videos in, of the power portal in the coming section sessions so th